gas welding. It is done by burning of fuel gases with the help of oxygen which forms a concentrated flame of high temperature. This flame directly strikes the weld area and melts the weld surface and filler material. Take your striker, hold it on a slight angle, side here, and you get a nice sooty flame. It's shiny on both sides and then those two shiny parts will join together into one puddle. Back and forth, let them join. There we go. There we have now a little puddle. I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. I've dropped the exposure on the equipment used for gas welding. Welding torch. Both the fuel gas and oxygen at suitable pressure fed through hoses to the welding torch. There are valves for each gas which control the flow of gases inside the torch. Both gases mixed there and form a flammable mixture. These gases ignite to burn at the nozzle. Oxygen Cylinder For proper burning of fuel, appropriate amount of oxygen required. This oxygen supplied by an oxygen cylinder. A black line is used to indicate oxygen cylinder. Fuel Gas Cylinder Mostly oxyacetylene gas is used for all general purpose of welding. Normally these cylinders have maroon line to indicate it. The fuel gases passes through it. Pressure Regulator Both oxygen and fuel gases are filled in cylinder at high pressure. These gases cannot use at this high pressure for welding work so a pressure regulator is used between flow. Application. It is used to join thin metal plates. It can use to join both ferrous and non-ferrous metals. Gas welding mostly used in fabrication of sheet metal. It is widely used in automobile and aircraft industries. Advantages. It is easy to operate and does not require high skill operator. Equipments are more portable than other type of welding. It can also be used as gas cutting. For detail please visit my YouTube channel and please subscribe. For detail please visit my YouTube channel and please subscribe.